two, one, go. All right, we're off and running with match number one, featuring the number one alliance against the number eight alliance. As the games go, the charge of the community as much as possible by scoring those cones and those cubes on various portions of the electrical grid. Right now, 1771. All that programmed by the human players for the first 15 seconds of the match. As 1771 was able to score that cube high for five points and their alliance. There's 1261, the Robo Lions. They're over in the power substation, the loading zone, collecting all of the power cone, trying to place it high as they possibly can on the grid, scoring. They have three side by side. That creates a link of the nodes in the power grid. That gives them five additional points right there. Those points can be valuable at the end of the match. That's 24-15. The Wirecats have that cube in their uh, cone in their possession. They're going to try to place it high across the tower if they can. They've got it. They're positioning themselves. The top pole is like those poles that you see on the side of the road, those big metal poles. The one in the middle, that's kind of like the wooden power poles that you see alongside of the road as they try to score as many as they possibly can. It's worth five across the top row, three across the middle, and two in the low low level, which is there close to the ground where they're storing all the materials as they work on the power grid. The Red Alliance scoring fast and hard as it's 51 to 23 right now with 63 seconds left to go at 1771. Moving, trying to get around 42-40. Nope, they go back into their power substation. They're in the yard. They're trying to find their yard manager to pick up those cones. They've got a cone in their possession, racing down the field past 42-40. The Trotec Warriors, they are got that cone in their possession. They're at the outer grid. They place it high atop that pole. That's worth five points. And it looks like another link in the node. That's another five points. That was a 10-point swing right there for the Red Alliance. It's at 66 to 43 with 30 seconds left to go. We're now in the end game with 42-40, the Trotec Warriors. They were up on the charging substation. Power, the power station, power switch. They're up there trying to gain those points. Each one of those robots, if they can get up there, if they can stay on that platform, if they can get that platform level, they will be engaged with the community gaining 10 points for each of the robots that is up there. Right now, there's two of them, 74-70 and 42-40. That's 20 points for the Blue Alliance right there. We've got three, two bots up for the Red Alliance, another 20 points for them as well. At the end of the match number one, the score was 77 to 43, but we don't know what the official score is until that Haas Formula One car takes off down pit row, leaving that painted streak on the concrete. All right, here's the F1. It takes off, and the Red Alliance victorious in that match. They move across to match number seven in the upper bracket, and Alliance number eight moves down. They're going to go to match number five and face the one with the less, least amount of score in this next match. <laughs>